Hello everyone, Tutu here. Today we're going to be playing some Vault Hunters. If you don't know, Vault Hunters is a really cool mod pack made by Iscow85, and today we're just going to make a really short temporary base. The first thing we're going to need to do is, of course, look at all this beautiful pink sand and find a tree to chop and maybe get off this island. I'm thinking maybe we probably should make a boat. So let's go over to this tree, but before we go ahead and break it, let's get some Vein Miner. Uh, if you don't know, Vault Hunters comes with a lot of skills. I'm just going to quickly grab some Vein Miner real quick. And there are many other skills on here, such as Dash, which is great to have. And in terms of extra skill points, I definitely have to get Twerker. And I would love Elvish, but it costs five, so I can't have it right now. Step Up, of course, is also really good. For now, I think I'll get maybe some speed so I can travel a bit faster. Yeah, speed is good. And experience as well. With that, all I have to do is press Control, break this tree, and bam! We have most of the tree taken off. Of course, I should have done more levels into Vein Miner, but this is enough just to get started. I'm going to quickly take this waypoint with me because they're good to have for later. And I think later on you can actually teleport with them. But for now, I probably will get into my boat, and I think I'll go north. Ooh, I am definitely going to see if I can go inside of this sunken ship and see if I can get some stuff. If I'm lucky, there might be a buried treasure, but I don't have any resources, so maybe I'll just get the map and keep going. So I did get a buried treasure map. I'm going to see if I can find it real quick. Someone told me you can actually press the chunk borders, and it's supposed to be in the middle, but I don't know if that's true. I mean, it doesn't really look like it right here, but I just hope I don't drown. But I gotta be careful. Oh, see, I'm taking damage. Ah, uh, I should just get out of here. I should just go. This is dangerous. Yeah, we're just gonna leave that treasure behind. We'll come back to it later on if, we're, if we want to, but probably not. I totally forgot I have the armor. I probably should put some of it on. I also need some food, but I don't really have anything to get them. Let's see if I can try and get it. There's one, there's two. Oh man, this is not good. I probably should just leave. Yeah, okay, let's just, we're gonna get different food. I also just realized I'm pretty sure one of these have cursive binding. Oh, I'm such a fool. This ocean is really big. I really hope I find some land soon. There should be some coming up, hopefully. Perfect. So there's a line up here. I'm just going to swim around the side of this and get to a better spot and keep going. Oh, there's also sunflowers. These are great to have. And Vault Hunters, there's a lot of different biomes. And sunflowers, surprisingly, are a little bit hard to find. So I'm going to just go ahead and take these. Thank you. And maybe I'll come back a bit later for more. But I can always use these. And a waypoint. I'll get that too. I'm also going to get this cow because I desperately need food. If you can mine my aim, my pickaxe. I'm so sorry, cow. This is probably torture. Thank you. Got some stone. Let's just quickly make some tools real quick. Uh, I guess we'll just do this, this, and this. And that should be fine. Now I got to quickly find those sheep. Sorry, sheep. Hello, sheep. Sorry about this. Thank you. Thank you, and I'm going to quickly make a bed so I don't get attacked in the night. Perfect. It's daytime. Now we can keep going. Just break the bed real quick, and we'll be on our way. We're going to basically just head north for a little bit, maybe go along the zero axis, and find a good spot to start digging. And I'll probably get some chickens along the way. So... In this version of Vault Hunters, there are actually a lot of different things, such as zinc, there's also some Certus ore, and a couple other things that are kind of around. But right now, I really just need to get coal and iron. Oh, perfect. That's exactly what I need. And coal. Perfect. Exactly what I need. So I've done a bit of digging, and I'm actually going to make a really small temporary home in here. Uh, all I'm going to do is I'm going to carve this out, place some stuff down, and I'll have a small little tiny base. I'm also going to make this base a bit easier, so I'm going to clear away all this dirt. 
Also in this mod pack, we can get some industrial hemp seeds, which I'm going to be real with you. They're just a waste of space. So I'm actually going to just say goodbye to these for now. I can always get more later. Bye. And with any base entrance, we also need to decorate this. So I'm just going to put these two blocks in here and make a little archway. And there it is. Look at that. Look at this beautiful little tiny archway. Of course, it's nothing magnificent, but it's good enough. Uh, next episode, I'll be going down getting diamonds, maybe going to the nether, and hopefully slowly making my way towards the end. I uh, hope you enjoyed today, and I look forward to next time. I will see you guys all next time. Bye!